Betsy from Cut and Corners Vinyl in Nederland, Texas. And today we just received, okay, one, two, three. Hey y'all, it's Betsy, and today we received in some of my subscription boxes. So we're doing a mass unboxing today because I received three yesterday and three today. So I'm re pre recording all the videos because I'm excited to see what it is. So I received my May 2020 Candy Club box, which looks like this. I'm covering up the address portion of that. Um, I did cut the tape, but I have not opened this up yet. We really enjoyed the box last month. Um, it was super duper cute and I'm signed up for the bigger jar. So they have a six ounce, which is I think $30, $29 a month. And then the bigger jars, which are $39 a month. But the kids really loved it. So when you open her up, it says live sweetly and you can see all the beautiful candy inside. But we will test her out. Oh, so it's all sours this time. I love sour candy, sour gummies. So the first one I got is blueberry sticks. Last month we got some chocolate and stuff. So let's open it up and test it. Mmm. So good. So good. It's like a Twizzler. Blueberry Twizzler. I love fruit flavored candy. Like sour stuff. One of my favorite kind of candies is Sour Punch straws and stuff like that. I love that kind of stuff. I also got some Cosmic Sours. So these are heart, or not heart, moon and star shaped gummies. Try one of those. Mmm. So cute. Absolutely adorable. Now, I got these last month, but these were good too. So I don't mind getting it again. And they're the blue raspberry sour belts. So let's test out one of these. Mmm. So good. Gamer will be mad that he didn't get to help unbox this. But he wants to play Bay Blades. And next up, I got some sour apple laces. So. And they do all come sealed, so you know that they're sealed for freshness. And no one touched them. Oh, if you could smell. You know, like if you go to a candy store, how they smell, that's just the. Oh, I love that way that smells. Just the perfect garden apple flavor. Mmm, so good. Oh, these are cute lemonade rings. So I'm guessing there's going to be some lemon flavored ones and then maybe some flavors to go with it. Let's try one of these pink ones. Darker pink. Those have a wonderful consistency and not too hard, not too gummy. Hmm. That's like a berry flavor. I'm not sure what berry flavor. Oh, it's pomegranate. And then last but not least, we got some sour octopuses. So cute. And I'm starting to keep the jars because I have glitters and all kinds of stuff. And they match my decor. So I'm like, well, nice to have. Oh, look how cute they look. Die dyed. But I think it's missing a tentacle. Yeah, there's only seven tentacles on this thing. There are only seven tentacles on all of them. Someone should have told them. But do I think this is worth it? Oh yeah. Because when we go to the candy store, and typically we go to a place called Lolly and Pops, the Woodlands Mall, 
close to my sister-in-law's house because we don't have a big one near us. And we'll spend a hundred dollars or so on candy because they have like gourmet gummy bears and stuff like this. So this gives us something to last. And typically like we still have candy left over from the last month's box and we're a family of five. So what's nice and this is what I like to do is I like to have stuff like this sitting around the house because even though I'm on a diet and stuff like that, being able to grab a piece at a time, you know, maybe one a day helps with that sweet craving, but doesn't send you overboard. So it's just learning to do it in moderation. So I love the candy club of the month box, candy of the month box. So it's like six different candies. Um, definitely think it's worth it, at least in my opinion. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button right down below. And if you hit the notification bell icon next to it, that will notify you when I post new videos, which is every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. But I guess that's it. So we shall see y'all on Wednesday. Bye.